Hey you guys, this is Michael at Rockstar Gallery. It's um, April 1st, April 1st. And I just wanted to thank all of you that enjoyed our massive annual March Madness event. Uh, beyond successful, we've been shipping all over the world and thank you for your patience for us to design so many different projects. Thank you so much. And timing seems to be everything because that was March, today's April 1st. And what happened today? Carl Koontz, the ultimate album cover artist out of Utah, drove here, okay, with an incredible shipment of his brand new art. And we spent all morning rearranging the gallery to show. Take a look at this, an original on canvas, oil painting, Hotel California. He even lightened up the areas that you cannot see on the original album cover. And if you compare Carl's work to an original album cover, they're dead on precise. There is no deviation, there is no tweak here or there. It's dead on. We have Hotel California below it. We have one of the most famous releases, Herb Albert, book topping. And unfortunately, I don't think that you can see the dimension, how he lays on this. It looks like whip topping, dimensional. It's coming off of the canvas. Here are the two originals. Now then, let's get started here. We have Bruce Springsteen, born in the USA. It's textured also. It's almost like the t-shirt's coming off of the canvas. And then we go to the smaller jaclays. These are prints from the originals. Hotel California and Fleetwood Mac Rumors. And it seems these are the two bookends for collectors. These two came out pretty much at the same time. They had relationships with the bands at the same time too, Don Henley, Stevie Nicks, and so forth. So there's always, there's a great backstory as to why these two go together. Then you have Miles Davis, kind of blue. This is Scotty's favorite. And then over here you have Aerosmith, Toys in the Attic. These colors are so freaking precise. The detail is just, is just incredible. Every single, Every single part of this is so accurate. I've been staring at the original cover a little while ago. There it is, just a little bit bigger, painted. Now then, come this way. I saved my two favorites. Pink Floyd, Animals, and the Division Bell. Now then, Carl lightened up the battery power station because on the album cover, this is completely dark. He lightened it up on purpose, so you can see what it actually looks like. And then the division bell, this literally looks like metal. Metal with studs. And the grass in the front, the trees, the detail in the back. We have the original album cover artwork, and it, it's kind of scary because every cloud is precisely where it's supposed to be. In both. So this, these two are probably my two favorite bookends if I had to pick them. And then finally, over here, if you like the Beatles, Rubber Soul, 24 by 24, every color, every face is stretched perfectly. And then this one down here is Abbey Road. I'm going to show it to you a little closer so you can see it in the light. Oh, perfect. Just perfect. The shadowing, the footsteps, even Paul's toes pointing up. We love Carl Kuntz. We just love him. Everybody that comes in here loves his work too. Hey guys, welcome. So anyway, I just wanted to share this with you. This is what happened today. All right, you guys, let's all have a safe, healthy April, and we'll stay in touch with you. Bye-bye.